Testing, testing, is this thing on? Channel 13, WNYT. So I've had movie stars in here. Mike Tyson had come in one time. I've had governors in, Governor Cuomo, Mario, and Andrew. I had Governor Cuomo's sister in here, Andrew's sister. We used to get her out of a lot of trouble when she went to St. Rose. Local TV personalities and, and news people. I still have customers from one of the local television stations that I used to work with years ago that come in. Some of the engineering department still come in to have work done because I got to know them going down there and doing my noon shtick, as I like to call it. George! Hey, George. And yes, I'm talking about my junk. Hi. How are you? Good. Nice, nice to meet to you. Have you back. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> You're new to me. <laughs> and we would gather up our stuff. We'd take a rusty rotor off a car or some other worn out part that we had done. And we'd take that down and we do a show and tell. Stand by. Welcome back. Now that the ground is drying up, the snow for the most part is gone. What are those spots left uh, on your garage and driveway? What's that all about? George Dunbrook from Dunbrook Mobile on Madison Avenue in Albany is here to tell us about fluid leaks. Well, fluid leaks, yes. Uh, there's many different kinds of fluids. In the Who car. else is going to ask you to talk about something that you're so, such a passion for, and only give you three minutes to talk about it? kind of neon color. Yeah, the kind of neon color, or more importantly, which is probably one of the most consumable fluids in your car, oil. Okay. People say, how do you do it? How do you get in front of the camera and, and, and tell people all these things? They say, well, you know, if someone walked up to you and asked you how to tie your shoes, and you love tying shoes, you could talk for an hour about that now, couldn't you? Oil, when it burns, can be like gasoline. Can smell. Well, to me, this is me tying my shoe. That are, uh, yes, the, the, the smell. That's, That's what the I would The gas smell. The, the smell. So what do we have right here? Okay. It's second nature. This is what's called a valve cover. And yeah, I got scars and dirt and things under my nails, components. but I still have it. Now you can't take that away from me. And, and my customers gave that to me just because they believed I could do things that sometimes I couldn't believe in doing myself. It's a good time of year to do it, George. That's right, because those spots aren't going to go away. <laughs> hey, George Dunbrook from Dunbrook Mobile in Albany. Thank you so much. Thank you. Back I, with a last look at your forecast. It's Stay dirty. with us. <laughs> it was a weekly spot for years. People would come to the station. They would say, I saw you on Channel 13, uh, or I know that voice. Where do I hear? Remember that voice from? Oh, yes, I heard you on Channel 13. So I've had people face recognize me, voice recognize me. No, you're on TV. Oh, is that right? Yeah, yeah, American Police One? I do. I see you on TV. And actually come in and still come in to this day as customers because they saw and they liked what I had to say. They said, You seem like an honest guy. Seem. So that means, okay. That was one of the ways I could reach out and get people's interest to come in and do what I do for them. What's your next question, doll? <laughs>